Hey, it's Fed, your intuitive guide again. So on the topic of marriage, divine masculine, divine feminine, I have another message. Healing can be done simultaneously while in partnership. Please don't get this, this distorted idea that you're worthy of love only and after you're done healing. Like, what the fuck? That's a lie. You can simultaneously have both, do both. So, because in that last video, I said everybody is a mirror. Every situation, every life experience that we live, every experience we live with another human being is only a mirror of ourselves. Yes, please pour into yourself. Please love on yourself. Please find self love. But that does not mean that you have to be 100% healed. To be in partnership with somebody. No. Because let me tell you. Most of your healing is going to come from that mirroring back and reflections through your partnership. Obviously, you are going to set those healthy boundaries and know exactly how and what you want a relationship to look like. And that's why healing is so important. Because through self-love and healing, you're able to say, this is what I want. This is what I don't want. This is how I want to be treated. This is how I don't want to be treated. This is what I expect, right? This is how I want to be feeling. This is what I want to be receiving. This is what I'm willing to give. This is what I'm willing to make somebody else feel like making a list. And if you haven't checked out my video about how i manifested my partner please check it out because it's not rocket science but you have to be willing to put in the work as well right because any life experience any relationship anything is always going to take work and effort more than anything it's effort but yes don't be fooled about you know this idea that you have to be 100 percent healed to find a beautiful partnership because that's not true like, I know one thing that I remember that I wrote down on my list was, like, being able to laugh. Like, having somebody that's funny. Like, if I'm not laughing, there's a fucking problem, right? Eh, like, that's not going to work because I like to laugh, right? So, making a list is super imperative because you need to know. You need to set guidelines and expectations, right? Because what about if you land somebody really nice, but they're serious and you don't like to laugh around them? Like, that's awful.